Hello, my name is Dr. January Hill, and I'm a bariatric and general surgeon in Macon. Today, we're gonna to talk about the coronavirus and obesity correlation. As we all know, the coronavirus does not discriminate against any individuals. However, older individuals and people with serious chronic medical problems are at more risk of catching COVID-19. And also, they're at risk of developing even more serious illnesses and sequela of this virus. There is a correlation between obesity and poor outcomes after contracting the coronavirus. In the United States, about 35% of the adult population is considered obese. Based on many studies done across the world, we now know that obesity increases the risk of developing diabetes, heart disease, hypertension, and respiratory disease, among other conditions. Individuals with underlying heart and respiratory conditions, as well as diabetes, are at an increased risk of experiencing serious complications with the virus. Due to the fact that many obese individuals have a weakened immune system, which is already working in overdrive to keep their organs functioning properly, they are at a higher risk of becoming seriously ill if they are exposed to COVID-19. Obesity leads to an altered immune function and chronic inflammatory state, in addition to mechanical difficulties in breathing and increased oxygen requirements. And as we know, one of the more serious symptoms of COVID-19 is difficulty breathing. Although we don't want to incite fear in any of our patients, we want you to be aware of the severity of the virus as it continues to spread throughout the world and in our communities. Overweight and obese individuals, along with the elderly, are at more risk of contracting the virus and becoming seriously ill if they have pre-existing medical conditions, such as heart disease, respiratory trouble, diabetes, etc. So for our patients, we have a few tips to stay healthy during this pandemic. Number one, we suggest you continue taking your vitamins every day, which you should already be doing, but now you have an even greater motivation to do so. We also encourage you to eat well and correctly so you have a strengthened immune system. We also can encourage you to stay hydrated by drinking lots of water to flush out the toxins in your body. Finally, we encourage you to continue following the CDC guidelines by washing your hands and wearing a mask and maintaining appropriate social distancing. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel and we'll see you at the next video. Stay safe.